Hello, hello, good day, konnichiwa. Um, I decided to just do a more proper um video than just the shorts I did. Um, to give a more update over what's been going on, what have I been doing, etc. So yeah, as you guys probably know. I was not active at all um, last week, uh, but there's a reason. Move the camera a little, hopefully that's a little better, and hopefully still the audio is in sync. Um, this is the reason why I've not been uploading at all on the course of the last week on my gaming channel. Plus, more. So yeah, so well, first last week we had um, my... Um, let me just mark that one below the marker and Arigato gozaimasu. So, um, first of all, last week from about Tuesday or whatever the fuck it was, not last week, but the week before, and, uh, um, oh god, I lost my day. My ISP was fucked. My speed for my Ethernet was only just like um, 5 megabytes a second up and down. And, um, and, um, oh god. My brain, my brain, my brain. Um, so, yeah. So I wasn't able to really do much. I had to use my phone to get proper network. So that week I wasn't doing pretty much anything else. So first now on Tuesday last week, it's Monday, two weeks after now. Um, so yeah, so that's one of the reasons why I haven't been uploading. Second reason why I haven't uploaded is because of this. What you're seeing on my screen right now is um, what you're currently seeing on the screen right now. So splitting a video right now, five sec. Um, and then, so basically, this video right here, it took me six hours to do. And that's because you see all these red right here? All of these red ones right here are, um, Gaussian blur is blur masks, because there were two people helping me move everything out from my old apartment because as you probably know i live next to an um, apartment or not apartment but next to a company beside me uh, and they offered to help me but they didn't want to be in the video so all of this right here is all from me blurring out so these like straight like Like, these next 10 minutes is me blurring out, pitching down voices, so all of these are voiceovers, all of these are just a single unnamed adjustment layer, which I have just uh, added things on top of. Um, <clears throat> okay, can I? No, God. Can I? Oh, God. Put you there. Put you there thank you um yeah this thing's looking kind of stuff um that way i can have everything on one screen um just put that up in the background um and now i got a message from this uh so yeah so this is what i've been doing so all of these are blurred out sequences of people um i'm gonna try to not show too much of this because the people that was in the video has not watched it yet, so I've still not gotten a hundred percent confirmed that I can release it. So I'm really pushing my computer at the moment. It's not having a great time with me. I'm recording a video. I'm playing back a YouTube video. I'm recording audio, and I'm working in Premiere. So you see, my graphics card is kind of honking. I also have a background in wallpaper. I mean. So yeah, so I've been working on this, and uh, yeah. So this, and we're, we're like jumping around, um, 
Wasn't there a clip in here? Oh. Yes, a few months later, and this was in new apartment. This was when we started the move in. Um, so, me moving. Now, this thing is not having a great time playing because I'm playing so much stuff on my computer right now, as well as having a. Um, well, this is not. I'm actually using the raw MP4 format here. I did not transcode this to Cinefarm UV 10 bit, even though the timeline is set to UV 10 bit. Um, so that is something that I'm going to begin to do when I'm doing IRL shit for my IRL channel is transcoding them to Cineform UV 10 bit first and then start to edit them. <clears throat> uh, which also includes me having to get some bigger SSDs and faster SSDs because as you probably know, I newly got a 2 terabyte Samsung SSD that replaced my Kingston 480 gig one. <laughs> For uh, my games, so my 480 went over to being my scratch disk for the time being. Let's just say the response time on that thing is not great, and uh, it's not having a great time. And I'm currently playing from... Uh, I'm playing from this SSD, uh, and as you can see, it's, um, it's fine for now, but it's definitely not one of the faster SSDs. It's definitely having a hissy fit keeping up. Um, so yeah, well, but you see my, C my CPU is not having a great time here. Um, so yeah, um, so this was all that. And then, well, this is me explaining half of my shit. Uh, now I'm going to have to mute this thing in order to send audio into, um, into, into OBS. So. Audio OBS is coming right now, and uh, yeah. The bedroom, I'm not too sure yet, but it's gonna be a romantic color. Not too bright, not too dark. Good. My bathroom is gonna get like a baby blue type of color on the walls. That needs to be water resistant, by the way. So yes. And I need a heater that can stand in here to actually heat stuff. And here, I don't know yet. We'll figure out the color. But yes, it seems to be going. I hope the audio is still in sync. I kind of fucked the audio up. But hopefully it's in sync. Yes, I did not mean to pull double audio. The skip is in here, um, I think, should be. Yeah, here is lots of cuts of me sending down the audio. The next day. And then this, so this is two days. This is the 8th of November. Um, and by the way, if you're wondering, I guess I could give you guys some info. This one, the audio, does have a 6 dB, 6 to 9 dB bass boost. Um, just so you know. So that's the reason. If you have some EQ on, it might sound a little bit intensive. But it's because when I'm editing, it sounds low to me, so I turn it up. So just know that if you feel, if it's a bit over bass, if you have a closer to flat EQ, it's actually not that bad. Uh, I'm sending this flat EQ to my monitors right now. Um, I do have subs too that are a bit, little bit cranked too, but most of the audio currently is just going to my speakers. Uh, since I'm not sending that high output level, and those are flat, those are actually um, plussed a little in the base, so they're fine on my monitors. Um, now, I know this looks very choppy, it's because my CPU can't keep up, um, but the original clip, uh, or not the original clip, but the so we're at the 
Okay, I can start it from the start, so uh, 1543 ish. <clears throat> and I was using a Lumetri. Um, Yeah, that's right. I did not do that in the apartment, but I did it here. So, Illumitri color correction uh, for these footages. I did not do it in the apartment footage. Uh, so, yeah. But now, um, did we say uh, 1543? So yeah, so that's this clip. Um, okay, sorry about that. I, uh, <laughs> my clock ringed, so yeah. So yeah, so that's the main reason why I haven't been that active. So yeah, um. Also, I've been working on my apartment. I just today got uh, wired up, the, or not today, but for like two days ago, got all the Ethernet down to the couch that I wired. Uh, next up is going to be wiring um, five wires into the bedroom, two that's going to go to the actual bed, and then three cables that's going to go to the little um, audio and lightning graveyard uh, where there's gonna go ArcNet and streaming ACN and X32 link. Uh, or we maybe we'll maybe make that four if we decide to do Dante back there and eventually move to a digital stage box back there. That's then hooked into the analog one. Also a little update if you haven't noticed, yes I have swapped cases. I've gone from the Corsair 760T graphite to the Corsair um, 7000D. Um, so I went from a big tower to a full tower uh, or super tower um, because I did, I just didn't have enough. So yeah, um, so yeah, so that's the network situation right there. And then we got at least three cables that needs to go into the roof here for two IP cameras. And one access point, and then I need at least two take cables going to the hallway for another access point in the hallway. So I have network all the way down, and uh, another IP cam. Two access points in so close proximity. You guys maybe think it's a little overkill, but ain't I overkill from before? And well, I mean, I don't know if you know about Trulls. He's a Norwegian YouTuber uh, and also uh, a big guy within productions and stuff. And I gotten some ideas from him from a new apartment and I got a new bigger apartment because I think you guys already know that this apartment is not big enough for me. Like, I can't live here for a lifetime and, well, rather speaking, I wouldn't either. So, yeah, um, right now I'm on 59 squares. Um, what I'm looking into getting is, uh, is closer to 67 or 70 squares. That's more the size that would be appropriate for me. Uh, if I shouldn't go insane. If I should go insane, I would probably like to have it more like 110, 120 squares. But what's going to be decent for me is going to be about 100 and... Uh, uh, or about 70 squares. Um, because, well, then I can have a dedicated living room. I can have a dedicated, like, gaming room, streaming room, whatnot. And well, if we have enough rooms, I can actually make my studio ID 
more true to life because then I can actually cut out the wall, actually put in a window and actually have a control room and a actual a rec room. So yeah. But I have more blogs coming. Uh, right now when I'm done recording this, I'm going to edit this. I'm going to... I'm going to transcode it, I'm going to edit it, I'm going to export it and get this up on YouTube. So yeah, so I'm going to do that. So thank you guys for watching. Little update for you. Links down below. Um, so yeah, stay tuned and stay awesome. Catch you guys later.